Here we have female cops getting owned by citizens. Please go to the links in the comments below to show the featured channel some love. Get rid of them. What you doing? Uh, taking camera, a couple pictures of the cars. What you gonna do with them? Well, don't know yet. Is that okay? Yeah. It's public property. Can you explain to yeah, him? Yeah, that's right. It's all right. You realize you messed Which up one? now. Which well, one? you can't. You cannot take pictures of me. Shut your I'm mouth. You. Well, you gonna go to jail number one. Well, I tell you what, if it's publicized, you will get. Sued, well, buddy. you going to jail, really? and you're gonna lose your job. He's gonna lose his job. Come in. What pictures do you want? Oh, uh, just I was just getting some video of the patrol cars. What's your name? My name's Ron. I'm a police manager. Okay, Ron. Nice to meet you. Yeah, no, I, my people like wreck police cars. So, but yeah, this is the corporal's car, and I do know the corporal personally. So I'm hoping he's okay. It looked like it happened April second, 2021. This ain't public property? No, sir. Ron White said it was. It's not. Okay, well, I'll leave then. All right, got your information. I'm going to do a field interview on you. Well, unless I've broken the crime, I can't give you that. Well, actually, sir, I'm just trying to make sure that they knew who was on the property. Ron White knows. Ron White? Mm -hmm. Want to call him for me? He's right over here. Come on. Not him. All right. This guy assaulted him, too, though. I told him, don't feel me, and he's been doing it. Let me go over here and talk to Ron. He says that Ron told him he was fine. Yep, so you need. Sir, you, know. you can't feel me. Y'all gonna teach him something? I'm me. You can't film me. Don't hit me again now. Oh, he's there. Unless you want me to show him that. I don't want to lock you up and get you fired. He's a matter of, well, you know what? Mm -hmm. Okay. No, what'd you say? You said, you know what? I said, what? What did he say I did? Um, he said this is private property and he just wants you to leave. Okay, is he allowed to touch me since he's one of your guys? I didn't say he was one of our guys. This is, this is I said he's one of the guys here that does more well, than Well, I know are. what he does. Believe it or not, I worked next door for 10 years. So I don't think I'm here because I'm for my health. Where they at? It was right out there. But after we went inside, Ron gave me complete permission. So whenever he gets back, tell mm -hmm. him he needs to call us and tell us that it's fine. Well, well like I'm gonna leave. I'm, matter of fact, I'm headed out. I was headed out now. Only reason I stayed. Oh, there you go. Hey, Ron. They said I couldn't be Did here. You I was give just. I took him back here after all this commotion. Yeah. We came out first. And I was leaving. So is he allowed to be here? Because this isn't public property. He said that you told him it was. Well, it's public property, but you have to have business here. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's not something you just walk in and start taking pictures. You didn't ask permission. You right. just started. It's just normal courtesy. Well, courtesy, but I understand that. But, it, you know. But it's not law, so that's okay, what so I Okay, so he didn't tell you that it was okay. All right, so if you would go Wait a minute, and wait. you didn't say it was okay? It was okay after all this commotion. Right, but he told me to stay. Well, I took him over here and he took... Yeah, we did. So what is he leaving or staying? Huh? Is he leaving or staying? Oh, I was leaving. He don't have He's to say leaving. that. All right. Yeah, I didn't say that. All right, have a good okay. day, sir. Thank you. Y'all have a good what day. What was your name? No, I don't give my name. What's your name, badge number? I'm asking you what your name is. Is that law for order? It. Yes, sir. Am I being detained? Uh, you can be if you'd like. Y'all have a good day. What is your name, sir? I don't give my name out unless I have to. Here comes the lies. And, and when law enforcement asks you what your name is, you do at least have to provide that. You don't have to provide any type of identification, but we Georgia do... Constitution Media. Here, I'll go ahead and call a supervisor. For okay, yeah, that'd be great. Is it B40? 2101, just that. Can I get a supervisor to my location, please? What was your name, badge number? I know you had to give that to you. Uh, my name is wrong. Deputy Justice. Thank we don't you. have badge numbers. We have computer numbers. And mine is C025. Well, thank you. Very nice. What were you doing? Deputy Clark. Clark, okay. You've been very nice. How long you been with the Uh About two years now. Okay, that's nice. You want me to walk to the road? Oh, uh, no, sir. We're going to wait at my car for the supervisor to get okay. here. Okay. Not being detained? You can be if you'd like to be, but right now I'm just needing your information. Now well, like I'm going back. back to work. So can I get your information, please, nope. sir? Nope. Right now you're committing to conduct. 
I don't think that's true. You need to be careful when you say that. I, I see the camera. I, I, mine's running just as well. It's okay. This oily conduct. Sir? Oh, I was talking to my... You're oh, live okay. on the internet. Okay. All right. Well, do me a favor then. If you no longer want the supervisor, don't be back on their property, okay? You got it, ma'am. Have a good day. And you be careful. You be, Hey, listen. You be careful, too. This guy's just walking around filming. Yet again, the cops are called. Check out the link in the comments below for the full video. What's your name and badge number real quick? Why do you need that right now? You, you made contact with me. It's Officer Masters, 198. Officer Tedro, 192. See, it's that easy. I oh, know, man. Hey, dude, I'm just trying to talk to you like a person. We just it's got just kind of weird, you know what I'm saying? Babe, so here's the thing, sir. We got a call that you were recording some closing procedures at one of the local shops. So the people were uncomfortable and asked us to come check it out. Okay? Um, you got a business yeah, card? You. you got a business card? I don't have one on me. I just gave you, you just gave me my name and badge number. All right, well, get it. Can I get it one more time? Just for the record? Um, What's your name? What do I? Name and badge number just for the record. I'm Officer Tedro. Okay. What about you? Officer Masters 198. All right. All right, sir. So, uh, what are you about doing today, sir? Like, is there a particular reason you're reporting the business, or you just have to understand that someone felt threatened, so we're just checking that out, okay? The Constitution is one of the best things we got right now, man. I'm sorry, I'm just speaking over the that traffic. Truck's over. I said the Constitution is one of the best things we got right now, so I feelings so. don't matter here. What doesn't matter? What, what does I, matter? I said feelings don't matter. Okay. okay. The feelings don't trump the Constitution. Here we go again. A guy knows his rights, so they feel the need to give directives. For documenting purposes, we need to know who we're I don't need it to go to a fusion center and then be put on the do not fly list and make it to where I can't buy guns because I want to take pictures of buildings that I own. Oh, that's not, that's, that's not, what it is. Yeah, I mean, what's going on but the report right goes to a fusion center, right? I'm sorry? Your report goes to a fusion center. It has to. No, it would just be documented on our logs of who I'm speaking with and I'd like to check you for warrants. And I'd like to check you for warrants. And I'd like to check you for warrants. Okay? So you, you want me to help you put me in jail? Do you have warrants? I'm not answering any questions. I mean, I mean, I mean, that's that's this line of questioning. Have we moved from a tier one conversation to a tier two now? We're just speaking, sir. I'm not here to arrest you. I'm here. Well, well, well obviously you are if you're going to try to check okay. me for warrants. Are you going to allow me to answer your questions? And speak with whoever you want. Who? Uh, you no, can go no, I've always been on the sidewalk. On the sidewalk. That's it. Okay. Taking pictures. I was down here taking pictures too. Okay. So I, I guess I don't understand what the problem is. There is no problem. I, like and here come those directives. Okay. But I'm not doing anything with my talk, correct? Correct. But we got a call that you were inside the post office and you were filming things inside the post office refusing to tell people what you were doing. Oh, okay, ba based, uh, based on the paperwork, way. based on the paperwork, I can go into the lobby and film whatever I want. Well, you sure can. All right, so that's so that so look. that's legal you're activity again. Over no, no, yeah. what I'm getting upset over is uh, postal employees for not being held liable for filing a false police report. Okay. They didn't follow. Well, well, they they, they, they made a false call. Was going on. Was they made a false call. You gotta understand the day and age we're living in. What day and age? Look, no, no, I, I, no, no, I don't because I don't, I don't, I don't know what day and age. I, I just know that freshmen two years ago learned about 9/11 as as a history lesson. They didn't learn about it as, as facts. Listen so, to me very carefully. If you want to walk up and down a public sidewalk and a public street, and you can videotape and you can record all you want, at the point to where your behavior comes disorderly and concerning to others, then we're going to act on it. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Right. I've looked okay. over the disorderly, but nothing I've done that way. Traffic. Well, I'm glad you're educating yourself on it. Yes, sir. All right. I have to. So you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes. Okay. So if we get reports of that, we're going to act accordingly. Do you understand? Legal reports. Because they've already reported that I was inside the building and I was not. I'll be right back. They see videotaping and they think that maybe you're trying to tape so you know how to get in if you are planning to break in later or you know or you're watching little kids or that kind of thing. It just makes people nervous. Watching little kids. This is a small town. Neither of which on public property is illegal. It's a small town. Okay. okay? And so people get nervous when they see activity that they're not used to. I understand that, but it's legal activity. It's so if I was running up and down in a chicken suit on the sidewalk, that would still be okay, though it looks suspicious. It would, and we'd still come and talk to you because it makes people nervous. But it's legal activity. It is, yes. So I'm being stopped for legal activity. 
I mean, you're coming to question me. I mean, I mean, I mean that, that that's what it boils down to. Again, I'm not going to go into it like you said either. Please don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.